take the basil and something like shipping on it, you know, <laughs> ship on it or shipping on it or whatever it is. I panicked. <laughs> and I thought, oh my gosh, what is that? I think I know what it is, but what I know is it doesn't really go with that term. And I like, it seemed like forever, but it probably was only like 25 seconds that Lisa was with me at that time. And I'm like, Chef Chris, um, what is shipping on me? <laughs> oh, yeah, you know, you just throw up the basil and you go, oh, I'm like, oh, I've done that for me. <laughs> but chef, you know, restaurants, you know, I, I go in it, I, I'm not um, fluent. Um, but also, you know, the cookbook that I put out, and I'm working on another one. You know, I'm, I'm an at-home mom or, or, uh, for a long, long time. I, I enjoy cooking. A lot of people are on the budget. I don't have the expense or the time to go shopping for this one little ingredient that's in Timbuktu at some store. So I really try to uh, cook and create recipes that are good, tasty, um, but that are easy, meaning you go to the store and though you may not have used that ingredient, at least you can find in the store that you always shop at. And um, so I try and, you know, cook with ease and enjoyment because there are people that are recipe. You said one quarter, man, one quarter. And I'm like, oh boy. I'm like, oh yeah, that looks like a quarter. Oh, that looks like some salt. Oh, that looks like that. So it was very difficult for me to, um, do a recipe book because I'm like, how much soul do I actually put in that? Because I think I do a lot less than what, boy, half a teaspoon looks like a lot. You know, because I'm like, hey, a little sprinkle here, a little sprinkle there. Did you do a little salt pepper in this? Um, I don't know where it is, is here. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't bring any. Hopefully, um, if we don't have salt and pepper, it's not tasty enough that we do on. <laughs> I'm trying to think of everything. You might want to ask him if you want. Okay, yeah, thank you, Lisa. Um, so anyway, I mean, that's just a quick synopsis. Um, you know, two of my kids are married now, and I thought for sure these daughter-in-laws of mine would come running to their mother-in-law, like, did we ever go home? I was like, oh, can you help me cook for your daughter? No. So I'm not sure why I expected that of them, but they're doing great. In fact, I think Tori is stepping up to the plate a little bit more because she is very, she's a very simple eater. She loves pasta. She loves more pasta. <laughs> she loves pasta. And she loves like chicken fingers or macaroni and cheese. But you know, Zachary is used to like me cooking. And, um, and so she's stepping up to the plate and being, you know, a little more creative. I went over to, uh, to their house for dinner and just, I said, Tori, you're doing great. Right. Just, just have fun with it and enjoy it. Because that's where you'll eat anything. And if not, he'll certainly tell you. Um, but 